Okay, some of the information tonight, the books will be available for any pre-sold orders. You can pick them up tonight if you wish, or you can just come get them anytime in the future. So if you if you reserved a copy, we're going to hold you for it unless you want to pick it up tonight. If you haven't reserved a copy, we do have some limited copies available tonight. Anything that's left over, we'll have for sale in the professional shop. The price is $34.99. A good portion of the proceeds go directly back to Ryan Allen, going through his PGA book work, um, helping for his educational allowance and pay for that schooling. Tonight, we'll do the book signing. If you want an autographed copy, anything written in there for the holidays, we're happy to do it. Uh, Brian will be some complimentary gift wrapping available tonight as well, too. So what we're going to do now is we're going to open up to any questions. I'll have Brian come around and just raise your hand. And if you have any questions, Ryan and I will answer them for you. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much, and I really am happy that you've done, done this. What's the most important thing you've learned about the history of Fountainhead and how can we use that in the uh, future uh, to promote their art tomorrow? I think it's just the history in general. I think uh, we didn't have a very good basis of our history. We, we thought most of the archives probably burnt down in the fire. We had a hard time finding any records of any information, so the newspaper was a good way for us to find some of that information. But just basically spreading the story, and hopefully the book will be a good medium to spread that information to some of the members. So if they're out to dinner or playing golf with a guest, they can just kind of give people some of the information, some of the great stories that are in that book you saw tonight. I'm going to try to upload it to our website. We, I'm not sure if the guy has a licensing who, who burnt it for us, but I can see if I can get more additional copies. Yeah, it says, yeah, his, his sketch says cut into the knoll. Okay. Yeah. How many copies of the book were printed? We printed um, 115, 115 copies. We pre-sold uh, almost 90 copies. We have, we have more coming too. How can we help you get this across the members how valuable this would be or how we can license the people that have this? Yeah. Um, you know, basically tonight, and hopefully this going to be word of mouth, we've done all we can do with the newsletter and email blast, so now it's basically up to everybody who's here tonight to help spread the word. Do it again in the summer. That's a good point. How about former members? How they know what's going on? Yeah, we, we contacted the Herald Mail, and we wanted them to come out tonight and put an article together for us. and. They declined to come out. They have other obligations and to come here tonight. So that's a good question. I'm not really sure how to handle that one. <laughs> I'm kind of expecting that after this performance this evening, that Broadway is going to be called. <laughs> It's something we like to do. Once we got into it, we really enjoyed doing it, so it wasn't really a lot of work for us. Uh, we, Mrs. Bullington, put together a nice book for our 75th anniversary. There were four books, and they had a lot of old photographs and, and different things in that book. And I contacted her once I found out she made them and see if she had any. They are, they are gone forever. We've searched high and low for them. So if you know anybody who's got those books, please let us know. Right. Were there any other professionals that played here in the gallery or you know? Most of them were females. Uh, Babe Deaconson played here. Betsy Rawls played here. And Mickey Wright played here. 
Um, those are the golf professionals. There's a lot of celebrities that play here as well, too, um, the book goes into. But it's, it's a nice read. It won't take you forever to read it. There's a lot of pictures in there. Um, but, uh, <laughs> so, you can, you can read it rather quickly, but it's a great, great coffee table book. Okay, if there's no more questions, you can come over and grab your book if you want tonight, or you can pick it up another time. Thanks for coming out. Appreciate it.